Hi everyone, merhaba, this is Ayşenur Altan. In this episode, we're gonna make delicious spread or dip made from grilled red peppers and eggplants ajvar. It is widely known in Balkanian countries. Please give a comment if you are from there and know this recipe. And in Turkey, we really enjoy eating, especially in breakfast. I'm also going to show you how you can can it to preserve year long. So let's get started. In my baking tray, I have about one kilogram kapya peppers and one kilogram eggplants. I just broiled them, turning it once. And after it is cooled down, right now I'm going to take out the stems, the seeds of the red peppers and also the skin. If you, while they are still hot, if you close it with another tray, it is easier to uh, peel the skin off. I continue to do the same to other peppers and put it in another bowl. So for the eggplants, I'm gonna get the flesh out. It is easy to make it with spoon. Just split it from the top and spoon out, scoop out actually the flesh. When you are making this recipe, uh, try to choose uh, bigger meaty eggplants, not small ones, so uh, you can get more uh, meaty parts from the eggplants. So I'm done with the first step. Uh, if you let them sit for a while, they will release its juices, you can drain that out. So it will be more easier to cook to a denser uh, ajvar recipe. I have two onions, three cloves of garlic. I'm gonna uh, chop it. And also I'm gonna use some olive oil and grape vinegar. So le let's begin to chop the onions. You don't have to uh, chop it very finely. Uh, we're gonna blend it anyway. I uh, heated my pan, adding uh, olive oil about 5-6 tablespoons and adding the onions to cook first. I had some uh, purple onion, red onion or we can say, uh, it is optional, I just had it, so I'm using it. I'm also going to roughly chop the uh, garlics and add it to my pan. And while they are cooking, I'm gonna uh, chop the grilled eggplants and red peppers. You can uh, make it finely here if you want, but still we, we're gonna uh, process it, so think it that way when you are uh, chopping. And of course, don't forget to stir the onions from time to time. While I'm in the kitchen, I like to cook all the dishes together. So meanwhile, I was making green beans in olive oil, great summer dish. I already shared, you can watch it from the links too. So my onions begin to brown. Now I can add the eggplants and red peppers. I'm going to continue to saute them a bit all together. This way it will also help to evaporate the, some of the juices coming from the uh, veggies. I cook it for about uh, 10 minutes, almost simmering and going to blend it 
Now to make a puree with the hand blender. After this point, uh, just cook it until it is a, a nice, thick, spreadable consistency. And add the seasonings. Some salt, hot red pepper flakes to give it some heat. Uh, you can also use a uh, hot paprika and also one of the essential ingredients a uh, grape vinegar it just it gives a tangy taste uh, completes the taste actually i added one tablespoon grape vinegar and one apple apple cider vinegar but it is optional, uh, I just had it, I wanted to experiment. So you can use only a grape vinegar too. And just taste it and add more uh, hot pepper or paprika if you like, as you wish, and it's done. If you are making it in small amounts like uh, three peppers and two eggplants you can eat it right away in a week but to keep it longer you have to can it to preserve so uh, as I did in the uh, previous episodes uh, to my pepper paste I cleaned the jars and the uh, lids by boiling it in hot water And while they are still hot and also my ajvar sauce, I'm going to uh, portion it, uh, close the lid and turn it over, let it sit until it is cooled. Make sure you check the lid so it is uh, canned securely and keep it in a dry, cool place. By the way, even though it was looking so much, I just put half of it to uh, one about 200 cc jar and the rest I uh, portioned to two small bowls. And for three of us, it was already uh, finished in one week. It is so delicious, uh, packed in flavor recipe. Just spread it to a slice of bread or use as a dip with tortilla chips or a potato chips. We mainly eat at breakfast and I'm going to prepare an Edel Etha special breakfast in the upcoming episode and going to serve this ajwar and also the ajuka spread on my table too. So stay tuned. And thanks for watching. I hope to see you in another delicious Turkish food recipes and travel vlogs. Afiyet olsun.